Hi guys, so I am back for my third video. Didn't think I'd actually film this many to be fair, but you know, I'm actually really enjoying it. So I did a poll on my Instagram and everyone wanted me to film a sort of favourite beauty and skincare products. So that is what I'm doing today, pretty much. Now I'm not a beauty guru. These are just the products that has worked for me that I love. And so yeah, I thought I'd just film a video talking about them and why they're my favourites. So please like and subscribe in this area down here somewhere. And I hope you enjoy the video. Bob's your uncle, really. So yeah, I'm not trying to say, you know, go get some Gucci makeup, get yourself a bit of Chanel. No, this is all really, really affordable. And it's still my absolute favourite. So the first thing is this. I have had this moisturiser for probably three years. It is the Intensive 7 Days Ultra Replenishing Lotion. Now this costs five or six pounds, depending where you get it from. And they sell this in Asda, Boots, Tesco, everywhere pretty much. And it is just the best moisturiser. It smells really nice as well. And I was googling the price, so I could tell you guys. And they also have it in a mango scent. So I think I'm definitely going to have to make a purchase of that. But I have tried so, so many different body moisturisers. I've used the Victoria's Secret ones, just because of the smell. But it's just a smell to get the money spray. Um, Soap and Glory, I've tried loads of theirs. But this is just so cheap and so, so good because it's so thick. And you just... Honestly, when you rub it in, it just feels moisturising and it just feels great. And it leaves your skin. It says long-lasting hydration for up to seven days, and I honestly agree with that. Absolutely amazing. Honestly, if there's one product in this thing that I recommend, it is this. And it's so cheap. Honestly, go and get your hands on this. The next products I'm going to talk about are all from clean and clear and these are honestly the three products that have cleared up my skin okay, so the first one i'm like i hope it's rattling a lot it is the clean and clear advantage rapid gel oh sorry that's there and i love this it's a clear gel i'll just put some on my hand which is honestly really the best part of it see it's just gone I put this on my forehead mostly or my chin in the morning and before bed because a benefit is where most spot creams are white so you can't put them on in the day you can only put them on before you go to bed this you can put on in the morning say so, you know you're going out later that night got a bad spot there put it on in the morning and honestly it would have gone down so so much by the end of the day and this little tube is five pounds and it is 15 mil, but obviously for a spot cream, you don't need a massive bottle because you just put the tiniest bit on, rub it in, and there you go. Let's just put this back in its box. The next product from this range is the Dual Action Moisturiser. Now this is oil free, which I think is very important in a face moisturiser because my face gets so, so, so oily and it's gross. But yeah, this is just feels really hydrating on your face as you can see now my skin is nowhere near as oily as it normally is and I just love this I put this on in the morning I don't normally put this on before bed I just put the gel on before bed but I use this in the morning and it just leaves my skin feeling nice and fresh throughout the day and then the last product from this range is the face wash it is in your if you think of any face wash it's that size it is 150 ml and I love this. It's sort of like a gel almost. Rub it in, it gets nice and foamy, makes you feel nice and clean when you're doing it. And it has, I think this is probably one of the main factors that has cleared up my skin over the past few weeks. And this costs £4.99 at Boots. And it is incredible. Honestly, don't waste your money on high-end face wash. Especially if this is the type of face wash you use. So I know people like the foamy one. I do have a foamy one by Simple, but I prefer this over it. It's just... I love it. Now, Biore Pore Strips. I know every single 
beauty person on this platform have probably spoken about these but I have tried so so many cheap pore strips and I tried one of these for the first time last week I did one this morning and it just feels nicer on your nose it doesn't lift up you have to stick it back down like it sticks but it's stuck and you know how it hurts a bit when you pull it off it sort of makes you feel like it's doing something and it gets rid of so so many more pores than compared to the other one and honestly it is nine pounds but it gets out so much more so you only need to use these sort of every two three weeks whereas if you've got the sort of worst ones you just use them more often because they only get out a little bit so it just kind of balance up so honestly if you haven't tried these please try them this is the I, they probably do do different ones so this is the ultra deep cleaning pore strips with witch hazel and tea tree i also prefer to get the white ones only because all the charcoal ones they just leave that sort of stuff on your face whereas these do not you peel it off and it's gone out you know out the door you go okay and the last skincare product i got sent this from glossy box and it is absolutely incredible for getting rid of dry patchiness on your skin but this tiny little 50 milliliter bottle costs 92 pounds and so yeah that's the only issue with this but if you do somehow manage to find it cheaper i would give it a try if you've got sort of really dead uneven skin because it makes your skin so so smooth Move on to makeup now this is another thing that i'm sure every person on youtube has mentioned it's the maybelline lash sensational mascara I don't know what to do without this. As you can see now, I decided to film with no makeup today just so you could see my skin. And I look like I have no eyelashes. It just makes your eyelashes look so long and thick and dark. And it's just incredible. Honestly. This is £9 from Boots and Superdrug. I think you can even get this in Asda. And it's just great. They've got black dark black i don't know if there's really a difference brown waterproof they have so many different ones in this range and it is just so good and like the colors of the bowl yeah it's still got that feel i couldn't get it off it's just gorgeous so i think the rest of the products are all from makeup revolution because they're honestly my favorite makeup brand and the first thing is if anyone oh where is that is if anyone has tried the, I don't remember what it's called, but the Benefit Eyebrow, you'll see what I mean. This is a honestly perfect dupe and this costs £4. So if you look at sort of the nozzle, it looks the same. And it blends out so, so nicely. It looks so natural. And the other side has a little spoolie. Mine is in medium brown because i like my eyebrows to be a bit darker than my hair as they're naturally darker anyway and this is honestly my favorite brow product i've used i've tried quite a few makeup revolution brows and i do love their brows but this is definitely the best and obviously i've used the benefit version of this they're the same and this costs so much less it's just a great size as well i love brow pencils because i feel like they're so much easier you can chuck it in your handbag for a quick touch up kind of thing rather than get your gel in the brush personally but obviously everyone has different preferences with eyebrows and i think these can look so much more natural so this is another product very much recommend now these are two products i'm aware they're both basically the same though they are the revolution concealers this is the conceal and define and this is the infinite bottle which is literally the same size as their foundation bottles and then this is the Conceal and Hydrate. And this one is just, I think this is the super size. So they, as you can see, and there is an even smaller one, but I don't have that because that runs out so, so quickly. And the price difference isn't that big. So just honestly get the bigger one. And this one is a 16 hour wear. They do both pretty much do the same thing. I'm not gonna lie. I think I prefer the Conceal and Define to the Conceal and Hydrate. 
but they are very very similar in formula and I have been using these for the long honestly since they were launched and they're so great like this is definitely a shape tape tube or even a if anyone's seen or remembers Kylie Jenner's line of concealers that she brought out these are the perfect dupe and this size is seven pounds i'm assuming this size is probably about ten pounds but if you then compare that to the kylie jenner one or the tarte shape tape it's a bit of a bargain the final product is another one of my absolute favorites i ordered this from beauty bay a while ago and let me just show you the covers it is a bit of a mess i'm sorry look it's just me in a palette and i've used this on my friends and one of my friends has actually gone out and bought it after using mine and this costs 12 pounds for a palette which i think is so so good and just honestly these colors my favorites are just the brown shades because they're like nice sort of orangey browns and then these glittery shades absolutely unreal this is honestly my baby and i have quite a few high-end palettes but i honestly reach for this one so so much more like i've got the urban decay if you look at the colors this is the urban decay naked heat and sort of the colors in this are quite similar and i honestly do reach for like we all know naked palettes are great but i honestly do reach for this one so so much more and you can get this on beauty bay and you can get this at super drug and i think cult beauty but and this is also the palette i use i use these two pink shades are the palettes i used for my prom makeup so yeah this is definitely a favorite of mine and just the packaging like look how gorgeous that is and it's nice it's a little sort of metal tin so you know if you drop it you're okay so yeah i absolutely adore that palette okay so that is all the products that i wanted to share today i might do another one of these might be like a monthly thing and when that used to be on the channel like one of their monthly favorites anyway thank you so much for watching this video and if you've watched all my other videos and if you've subscribed then thank you and i will probably do another one in a few days time so 